so uh, welcome to this video. My name is Ben. Thanks for stopping by. Today I'm going to show you how to light a pilot. Now this applies to basically all different types of pilots. Uh, typically what you're going to see is you're going to have a thermal uh, couple, which is this uh, copper wire here. There's no gas going through that or anything. All it does is senses that the flame is operating and that allows the gas valve to stay open. That threads into there. This just needs to be lightly tightened. Don't over tighten those things or you can break them. So let's see if I can get you a good view in here. I'll get you a wide angle perspective. All right, can we see it from there? Uh, not the not a greatest view. We'll see what we can find here. There you go. That's a pretty nice view. So, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to hold this over to pilot mode here. In this case, I lift it and then push it over, like so. You can hear the gas going a little bit there. So that's what we're going to do. Now, a lot of times it's a knob that you turn until it says pilot and then you push it in and hold it down. But in this case, it's just a little bit different. So, um, we're going to go ahead and set this here. And now I'm going to go ahead and hold this over. And we're going to go ahead and light it. All right. It lit quite effectively, as you can see. I will turn off the flashlight so that you can actually see the flame, maybe. Sorry about that. There you go. So that is running. Now we're going to hold it for probably like 30 seconds before we let it go because it's got to have time to warm up that thermocouple. All right, been about 30 seconds. Now we're going to let go of this here. And the pilot stayed lit. Now, if the pilot would have went out, most likely you would have had a bad thermocouple. And uh, what you need to do then is just replace that. Just look at the approximate length that you have uh, to reach from your gas valve to your thermocouple. And then uh, order the right length. I'll put a link in the description to different thermocouples and different lengths that you uh, might need. And uh, it's a pretty simple process. You just spin this nut off right up here, pull that out, and uh, replace it. So. Um, that's how you light a pilot, and now all we have to do is turn this to on, and we're ready to fire this furnace up. So, that's been it. Thanks for watching. Hit that thumbs up button if it helped you out, and we'll talk to you in the next video.